I, I think there's benefit to diversifying your assets, both in terms of how we think about duration and spots on the yield curve, as well as thinking about credit. We absolutely uh, are encouraging investors to barbell their approach to fixed income today. We agree, 5% is really compelling. So if we get into this environment where yields stay higher for longer, this is fantastic for fixed income investors. Yeah. What we want to be mindful of is there's a base case that the Fed eases one to two, maybe three times this year, though I think they're going to walk back that median dot plot when they release the next dot plot in June. But we do have to be mindful of tail risks that are forming. So when opportunities present themselves either in munis, taking advantage of a steep yield curve, locking in some duration, or differing spots on the treasury curve, corporates which spreads are tight, but balance sheets are healthy and you're picking up a lot of excess yield, we think a diversified approach makes a lot of sense here. You mentioned munis. I know you have some experience in munis. I'm a, a big fan of the New Jersey municipal bond market. Talk to us about your advice you're giving your clients these days about municipal bonds. Is it state specific or is it just an asset class you want to have some exposure to? You absolutely want exposure to munis. I would say both investment grade as well as high yield. her voice changes. She's yeah, just, a, yeah. she's just, it's like, you know, she's at Harvard and she's like, Harvard fellows, <laughs> muni bonds. They're like, tra they, they trade for 1%. I right. mean, you know, they're, they're continue. There's several reasons to have enthusiasm around yeah, munis. No, no. Number one, tax efficiency. If you look at yields, whether it's investment grade around a 370 or the high yield muni index closer to call it a 560, that's really compelling. 6% plus, 9% plus tax equivalent yields in an era of the market where balance sheets remain quite healthy. So for those of us right. that don't love taxes, you absolutely <laughs> so want to be you're in a meeting at Rockefeller with Rishir Sharma and you're looking at the triple B minus Chicago GOs. Yes. What do you do with a Chicago GO as they look to bankruptcy? I mean, well, you know, it's like the new California. I think Explain bankruptcy, that to Rashir, bankruptcy he's listening. is certainly maybe a jump from what the balance sheet looks like today. And if you look at Illinois, Moody's Monday, the state level, positive outlook, you've had five balance budgets coming from the state of Illinois. Who would have hmm. thought that, yeah. right, Tom, 10 years ago? But what you've seen in the last several years, really post-GFC, right. is municipalities being <clears throat> financially responsible. Now, you still have to do your homework, right? Bottom-up research matters. Right. There's bifurcation in key sectors. But we think it's really prudent for investors to have that allocation to investment grade, separate accounts, right. focused on high grade, but also an allocation okay. to high yield and all the opportunities Thanksgiving there. dinner, yes. you're with the fam. Yes. They turn to you and they say, we want to take advantage of tax-free bonds. Yes. That's the way it always yes. goes. How should your mortals buy yes. municipal bonds? Well, they should absolutely use uh, a professional, such as RAM, to really focus on doing that bottom-up research from credit, optimizing yield curve, really leaning in and out of the market, depending on the seasonals and But periods. should they be buying individual paper, Nuveen Unit Trust out of Chicago, we should buy funds, ETF switch? Individual bonds for your separate account, using an asset manager, and then funds within the high yield space, which is why why we're expanding and really excited and enthusiastic about three veteran high yield portfolio managers that are coming in house in the coming. What is this an really HR call? <laughs> it absolutely is, Tom. Absolutely. I've got the laddered uni portfolio. I'll bet you do. And we talked about this last yes, time, Paul, did. and you still have the ladder. Optimize I do. that yield curve. Let's absolutely. chat offline. 